Time now for Eyewitness News. Call 12 for action. A meter mess up cost a local restaurant thousands of dollars. And when they couldn't get the utility company to refund what they thought they were owed, the owners called 12 for action. Consumer reporter Susan Hogan joins us now with the details. I have a question for you. Would you pay your neighbor's gas bill? Of course you wouldn't, but Cobb Restaurant in Providence was unknowingly paying another business's bill, and when they went to collect what was owed to them, it wasn't as easy as they expected. It's a busy lunch hour at Cobb in Providence. Gas flowing on the stoves, the grills, the meters registering every bit of gas being used. All I knew, I was paying for three gas meters, and I knew it wasn't possible. Sylvia Mobaya, owner of Cobb, says their gas bills were out of control for years. It wasn't until they traced all the meter lines did they realize they were also paying the gas for another business next door. When Cobb refused to pay the bill from the incorrect meter, National Grid sent their account to collection, and according to Sylvia, threatened to shut off their gas. But every Every time I call them, we'll shut your gas off. How can I be without gas in, in a restaurant like Cobb where everything is run by gas? National Grid did eventually refund them for one of the incorrect meters, but Sylvia said they were paying for two incorrect meters. Frustrated that the utility company wasn't moving fast enough, she called 12 for action. Your reputation for protecting the little guy. Thank you. And that's why I came to you. We contacted National Grid in a statement the company said. After an extensive review of customer billing and payment records going back to a period prior to National Grid's purchase of the New England Gas Company, it was determined that the customer had been improperly billed for an extended period of time. Just recently, Cobb received a large refund from National Grid. The meters have now been corrected. But still, thanks to you, I I mean, I really now have uh, 16000 in refund. $16,000 in refund, she's right. Now, National Grid says that part of the roadblock in solving this issue with Cobb is because of the difficulty they had in tracking down old billing records from New England Gas, the previous company, which was done in a separate accounting system. And if you have a consumer problem you need help solving, contact our Call 12 for Action Center Monday through Thursday from 11 until 1, hotline 228-1850. Or if you're interested in becoming a Call 12 for Action volunteer with me, you can call that same number you see right there on your screen. I'm consumer reporter Susan Hogan, Eyewitness News.